guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm just chilling on the floor today. I wanted to make this video a little bit different, but today I'm so excited because I went shopping on lulus.com. If you guys haven't shopped on the, that website before, you have to go check them out. I have gotten some of my favorite things off Lulu's. This is like not sponsored whatsoever. I just truly love Lulu's because they have such affordable things as well as like higher end things as well. So if you wanna go shopping online when you're like, don't have a lot of money in the bank account, but you need like a cute top, they have something for everyone. So that's what I really love about them. Another thing that I love about Lulu's is they put some of their best sellers in a group and then they allow their customers Customers to leave pictures and reviews and stars and ratings it makes online shopping so much easier because I'm super tall and so when I get things online I'm always a little nervous and they end up not fitting me so like you guys know my favorite jeans that I just got from Lulu's I wear all the time they're the Toby high rise like light wash denim jeans I got another pair today and I'm so excited to try them out it's just a different color I read all the reviews they were like in their best sellers list and I felt like very confident but a little uneasy because I never really ordered off Lulu's a whole bunch so I wasn't sure and then when I tried their jeans on at home I'm like Oh my gosh, I see what everyone's talking about. These are awesome. So let's go ahead and get on into the Lulu's haul. I chose all of these pieces from the best sellers list and we're gonna try them on. I haven't even tried them on or like opened them up yet. So we're gonna try them on, feel them out and see what I think about the best sellers list. So the first thing that I picked up is from Z Supply. I really needed a basic white t-shirt. I had one and it just got shredded in the washing machine. So I wanted one that would kind of cover my butt. In, in the picture, this looked long enough. So this is literally just the most basic white v-neck t-shirt. It has a basic little pocket right here, which I think is just super simple and cute. And then it looks like it does go a little bit longer in the front and the back than the sides. We're gonna try that on in a second. I think everybody needs a good basic white t-shirt. They can just like throw on a leather jacket or throw on a jean jacket or just walk around with a pair of jeans and you can dress it up or down. So. That's why I love white t-shirts. So these are my favorite jeans ever. If you were part of my family, you would know that I wear my Toby High Rise jeans from Lulu's every single day. Like I'm surprised I'm not wearing them right now. Honestly, I'm wearing like sweatpants right now. But if not, I would be wearing these jeans. So I got them in a different shade, different, is it shade or different like tone or different color? I guess just like a darker wash because I don't want people to know that I wear them every day. So I probably should get two pairs, right? So everybody on the rating said to size up in these so they'll fit more comfortably and just a little bit looser. So I got a size seven. I guess normally I'd be like, normally I'm a size four and I sized up to a seven and they fit, well at least my other jeans fit like a glove. They fit so comfortably, not too tight. I hate when jeans are too tight around my thighs and I only can wear them for like a few hours. I want my jeans to feel comfortable. I'm gonna try this pair on and see if they fit the same today. And I just love the wear and tear on them. How cute are those? I also bought another pair of jeans that I've been seeing on their website for a very long time. They got really good ratings, and so I wanted to try them out. They seem a little bit tighter than my Toby High Rise, um, but we're gonna try them out and see. So these are the Mia Mid-Rise Relaxed skinny crop and I went ahead and got a size seven as well. They say they're a very relaxed fit. So hopefully they fit similar to my other ones. They actually look very similar to the light wash Toby high rise I have, um, but they have cuffs at the bottom, which is very cute. So we'll try these on. I don't know if I'm ever gonna get away from my Toby high rise, but we'll see. The next thing that I ordered was a bodysuit and this is actually from Free People, but I don't think the price was too bad. I just wanted like a loose, black tank and then it has this little lace on the bottom kind of like underwear so you can just slip it on this looks a little big i got a size medium which is my normal size um but it just feels super comfortable and relaxed so i'm excited to see how a bodysuit works on me because i've never worn one before so the next thing i got are these shorts from rvca i love this pastel -y pink kind of color it's actually not really pastel it's more of a muted pink um this is like the ideal nail color that I want to get every time. I went a little crazy this time, but every time I go to the nail salon, 
which isn't often. I normally get this shade of pink, but I love these shorts. I just love loose, flowy shorts that you can put on with like, again, a white t-shirt and just run out the door. So these looked very comfortable. I sized up because again, I'm very tall. So I wanted to make sure that they covered like a lot of my booty and my thighs. So we're gonna try these on. I hope they're not too big around my waist. Okay, so the next pair of pants that I got are so cute. They looked really good on the model so I hope they look just as good on me. Um, probably not, but we'll see. They're just this green kind of khaki style pant. I love the little belted waist that's tied at the front, and I think that they go high-waisted, and then probably to about the ankle, I think. We'll see. I'm pretty tall, so maybe above the ankle, but I can't wait to try those on. And so I got these two pants to go with this white top that I'm about to show you. Yes, I love white tops. I especially love linen white tops. So this one was very highly rated on their website. It comes in a bunch of different colors. It's super lightweight and actually really, really soft. So I thought that would look cute paired with these white pants. I actually think the model is wearing that in the photo. Um, again, it's just a basic white v-neck but less of a t-shirt material and more like linen-y and then I thought that would look really cute with these shorts as well. I got a size medium in this shirt. It looks a little wide but I think that's how like the style is supposed to be kind of boho kind of like oversized. So the last three things that I got I'm so excited about. I saw this hat on their website and the model looks so cute in it. I definitely don't look as cute as her. I already tried this on, but look how cute this stinking hat is. Okay, let me like make it look cuter. So the few things that I love about this hat so much is that it has a hole in the top. So when I wanna like throw my hair up into a bun, I can just have the bun sticking up out of the top. And then another really cool thing about this hat is it's very bendable. So you can kind of bend it to how you want it if you wanna like block the sun out of your eyes or like lift it up. Another awesome thing on their website is that this is like a pack and play kind of hat. So you can just roll this up and it will keep its shape if you like throw it in a bag or throw it in a suitcase. I have so many hats that I've ruined trying to take on vacation with me that are like big and floppy that I've ruined just because they get smashed. So this is super bendable. It's from the company San Diego Hats, but you can get them off Lulu's. So I am so excited about this hat for the summer and the spring because it's so sunny outside. So I really like to keep the sun off my face. When I was younger, I used to burn the heck out of my face and my mom would get so mad at me, but I'm like, mom, I want a tan face. Not anymore, people, not anymore, because I have seen some wrinkles start to come in. So not this year, people. We are gonna wear a hat and we're gonna protect our face and our skin so we won't get wrinkles. Okay, the next two things I got are shoes. I love Lulu's shoes. Their flip-flops are so stinking cute. These are more like slides. They're all around $15 to $18. I think these were $18, and I just love that they're nude sandals. They're so, so cute. I love how basic they are. Again, you can slide these on with literally any of the pieces that I picked up today, and you'll look good. But let me just tell you what my favorite sandals are by far and i'm so happy to show you guys i saved one of my favorite pieces for last because they're just so darn cute and these come in a bunch of colors they remind me so much of easter let me switch them so they're on the right side but look how cute these sandals are am i just crazy or are these the cutest things you've ever seen i love these so much oh and they have like a mustard yellow i think which i almost wanted to pick up but i think i'll wear the blue more often now it's time to go try on our outfits so let's do this ladies okay so i moved you guys into my bedroom just because the lighting's a little bit better in here it's not as yellow right now all right so here is the basic white tee it's literally just a white tee i have a little bit of a dark bra underneath so if you guys see that that's what it is but I love it because it does it goes longer in the front and in the back I wouldn't necessarily say it covers my butt all the way but it does a good amount of it I really love it just because you can like tie it up 
tuck it in or do whatever you want with it. So literally so basic, but I've been needing one for a really long time now. Um, and the, I would say it's just a little bit see-through. So if you just wear like a lighter bra or a bralette, it's not too see-through that you'll be able to see those. It's just because of my darker bra I have on right now. All right, you guys, so here are the Toby high rise jeans that I love and I rave about so, so much. These are the dark wash pair though. And I would say that they fit very similarly. Um, I feel like the holes are in a little bit different spot. I can try on my other jeans to see, but I really, really love the dark wash on these. But if I were to choose, I would say that I love the light pair the best, um, but the dark pair is a good like change up. So that is what I'm wearing right now. Oh, and then I just decided to throw on these babies. And here's a little mirror shot of them right here. Sorry if you guys hate feet. Feet are kind of weird to me. Um, but yeah, I love them. And they're actually really comfortable with this like stretchy material on them. So I love, love the bows so much. The jeans fit really well too. I noticed my other jeans have gotten a lot looser as I've worn them and like worn them in. Also my other jeans, the holes have worn in. So like you'll start to see a lot more fraying. And then here's the butt on them, which I like the wash because it kind of just lifts your butt up a little bit. Okay, yes, so I slipped on my other jeans just to see if the holes were in different spots and they are. Um, the other jeans that I just purchased, they have like a hole here and maybe a hole here, which I feel like aren't as flattering as these just because this is where women's thighs are usually thicker. So to have a hole here just isn't as flattering as like down here. But you guys can definitely see as I've washed these, um, they've just been worn in more. So these are my absolute favorite. The other ones I like, but just aren't as as great and then here are the backs of these so I just wanted to slip these on and show you guys these are my favorite jeans also I have on the nude sandals right here which I love they're so comfy um, do they look like a big band-aid across my foot I just literally thought of that but maybe not I don't know <laughs> they're so cute though okay so here are the new jeans that I just got these are the Eugenia um sweet thing light stretch jeans and i actually really love these as well um lulu's does such a good job on their light wash here are the cuffs on the bottom i'm a little tall so i wish that the cuffs were just a little bit longer but they're not too bad so if you're shorter than me i'm 5'10 then the cuffs will probably fit you perfectly but here's the booty and again they do a great job on the booty just with the wash making it a little bit lighter here and darker down here so your booty looks lifted oh my gosh you guys this outfit is me at a hole like i'm so excited about it you have no idea okay now i see why everybody loves this top it's like perfect it's so stinking cute on. So it's just this really like linen-y material. It has flowy sleeves and then it's kind of cropped and then it goes longer in the back. So now that I've tried this on, I'm like, okay, I understand the obsession and I think I need more colors. And then I've come to the conclusion that Lulu's just has all around good fitting pants, at least for my body type. Oh my gosh, these pants fit so well. I love how high-waisted they come. They come like right in the middle of my belly button kind of um, and then this little tie is adorable it kind of has a paper baggy waist as you guys can see right there this is the most comfortable cute travel outfit like see me in the airport oh my gosh love it I want to go to the Bahamas or like Africa on a safari or something okay wow these are so adorable I'm so glad I picked these up don't mind my pale legs but I'm glad I got the large because they fit longer and then you can just like pull in the drawstring to like your normal size medium, which is really nice. This is how they look in the back, which they're not too short at all. So I really love that. And then again, with this top, it's so cute. So I think I need to pick these up in another color. I'm pretty sure they had multiple colors. Wow, I love these. Lulu's, you're the literal best. Here is the black bodysuit paired with the mid-rise jeans and I don't know, like, this bodysuit isn't making me scream at all. I'm kind of like, it's just a basic tank top. Um, I don't really see the need for an actual bodysuit for this. So, like, I would just go and pick up, like, a black tank top, and it just is the same. I don't understand what these strings are for. Maybe for hanging up? 
I don't know. Maybe this is just a little too big on me. And actually, I think I read on the reviews to size down, but I was like, eh, I like oversize. So I ended, so I ended up getting my own size, which I kind of regret that. I kind of wish I would have gotten a size small instead of a medium. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I'm really gonna keep this. It's not like flattering, it's kind of billowing. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with this hat, but honestly, the fact that you can like pile your hair up on top of your head without having to like, take your hat off is really nice and then also the fact that you can roll it up and it still looks the same and it's super bendable is ideal so i'm still wearing this hat but i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye